That is the sound of Capital's talent. That's right, in under a week, Capital High School will be hosting its very own talent show with student performers and audience interactions. Good morning, Capital. I'm Sawyer Conklin. This morning, we debut the trailer for the 2022 talent show. The Capital Talent Show is in less than a week. Here's a sneak peek. Eleven contestants. One hour. Three judges. One night. Who will survive? Because it turns out you will be witnessing it soon. That thing I told you about. Well, it's happening. And it is happening soon. Someone can witness it. You can be that someone to see it first. Again, the talent show is this Tuesday at 6 p.m. in the Performing Arts Center. Tickets are $5 at the door. Be sure to bring your friends and family members. Everyone is welcome. Turning to other news this morning, there's a conference coming up that some of you may be interested in attending. Here's Rebecca Gowan with our report. Stay Woke is a day-long conference that empowers students of color to use their voices and build their communities. All students are welcome and lunch and transportation are provided. It is on Tuesday, May 24th at St. Martin's University. You must register by next Saturday, May 14th, and submit a permission slip to your advisor. You can register at their website, Stay Woke, and find more information. Thanks, Rebecca, and remember to stay woke out there, Capital. And now, news for seniors. As part of the graduation program, Capital would like to recognize any scholarships that you have been awarded. Please bring a copy of scholarship award letters from organizations or scholarship award letters from the college you will be attending next year to Ms. Kickner in the College Career Center by 3.30 this Friday. And now, here's Charlie Cook with What's Good to Know. ASB executive elections are open now until May 13th. You must have a 2.75 GPA minimum, have good attendance, be a full-time on-campus student, be in good standing with teachers and admin, and be willing to be in the advanced leadership class during your term. If you're interested, please stop by room E2 to speak to Ms. Elon. Attention CHS seniors, if you are signing a letter of intent, please let the athletics office know via email. Any students interested in attending summer leadership camp at Camp Sispis, see Ms. Elam for an application. Summer leadership camp is open to all CHS students. Tickets are now on sale for Cougars Productions showing a Matilda. Student tickets are $8, can be purchased on the CHS website or at the door. Show dates are May 12th, 13th, and 14th at 7 p.m., and May 14th at 2 p.m. It's time for Spring Smarter Balance tests. The 15th and 19th are 10th grade English Language Arts tests, and the 24th and 26th is 10th grade Math and 11th grade Science tests. Please bring your fully charged Chromebook. No phones or other electronics are allowed during testing. That means if you finish early, you will need to find something quiet to do until everyone in the room has finished testing. Capital will operate on a normal schedule for those testing days. Buses will operate on a normal schedule for students who are testing and will run again two hours later for students who are not testing. See Ms. I and C1 or Ms. Williams in the main office if you have any questions. Need a first aid kit for the car, camping trip, or even your pet? HOSA is selling first aid kits until May 27th. To order, find a member of HOSA or go to the CCRC to fill out an order form. Seniors, the last two days of initial prom nominations are today and Friday. Look for the table by the library during lunch. Finally, lunch today is chili with beef or vegetarian chili with cheese, three bean salad, baby carrots, cornbread, and your choice of fresh fruit. And that's as good to know. Well, Cougs, that's all for today's broadcast. Make it a good morning, Capital.
Thank you for watching Coog TV. Next, the Pledge of Allegiance. You may now stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.